Welcome to Root Beer Circus. Another bedtime review. Bedtime review with me and you. Oh, you just spilled blood <sighs> on your face. I did. It's so hardcore. Um, what did we just uh, see, Samantha? Listen, 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 listen. Linda, listen. Listen, Linda, listen. Linda. <laughs> we just saw Captain Marvel. We did. <clears throat> I fucking loved it. Yeah, me too. I loved it, and it was so much better than Wonder Woman. Like if we're going, Whoa, that's, dude, like so much better. I liked strong. it so like I'm uh, one, better than uh, Wonder Woman. Listen, my quick synopsis of Wonder Woman is: dope bitch gets real strong and does cool stuff, right? Still falls over a dude. Like it's always about a dude. Oh, you Captain Marvel was just a fucking badass, and she just like grew into herself. And ugh, I love it. I love it. Um. This is a non-spoiler. Non-spoiler part. Uh, I thought it was a great movie. I thought I, I told Samantha that I saw some reviews online that were like, "Eh, it was eh, it was it was uh, unmemorable." I don't. I disagree. A hundred and ten percent. It was great. It was not Avengers: Infinity War, and it didn't need to be. You know. Not, I mean. That's good because it's a different movie. We're we're eating ice treats because it, it's bedtime. Um, I didn't want a popsicle. Okay. But I don't like this though. It's like not that good. <laughs> <laughs> um, dude, they're like uh, blue man versus green man versus cool girl. Who can fly? It's that's so, what, it's, that's that's what's great about watching these movies with Sammy because she's like not in deep on the Marvel things. Like, even when we were driving home, I said, oh, did, you know, we, I saw a reference in the movie from Captain America, and you said... I'm, I don't, I've never seen the first Captain America. <laughs> so it's like, okay. Um, but, um, I, I mean, I've seen some things. Listen, Nick Fury in this movie, it's a whole new side of him, and it's still Nick Fury. You know, don't fuck around. But, played by but, Sam Jackson. Sam Anderson. But it's like, he's great. He's obviously, you're like, oh, damn, there he is. There's that guy. Um, her sidekick, well, no, not her sidekick. Captain Marvel's friend from the past. Yeah. Crushed it. Believable, yep. mm -hmm. lovable, real. Yep. Um, the outfit choices were fun. It was 90s. It was based in the 90s. Blockbuster, uh, Gwen Stefani, Nine Inch Nails t-shirt. Yeah. That's all you need to know. And uh, it was very much like, uh, it was several different types of movies throughout. It was like a I Don't Know Who I Am movie and a Buddy Cop movie. And uh, holy shit, let's blow some shit up in the last act movie, which is great. I love okay, that. That's literally called like uh, a movie. A story. No, there was several that's arcs. A, that's a story. You just, you don't know how to use that word. There were several story mm -mm. versions in this movie. This is why we're professional reviewers. Yeah. Um, I thought it was cool as far as Marvel movies go. I was a fan. So, okay. I'm not really reviewing anything. I just keep saying I like it. Um, you know, you, you learn in this movie to trust some people. Mm -hmm. and, and some of them go beyond your expectations. And some of them, they don't. They don't. You get mad and then you watch shit go down in her hands her hands are psh, her hands are proton hands so she's like she just is a weapon she's like this cute funny really emotional like strong ass weapon and it's just like the whole movie they're like don't use your emotions you're a warrior <laughs> and she's like i'm a fucking bitch Whoa, was like, a <laughs> You get a lot of kicks saying bitch, these movies. Empowering bitch. I didn't yeah. mean bitch interrogatory. Brie no. Larson, shut up, Brie Larson. I think she crushed it. I think everyone crushed it. I think she did. Um, I feel like the underlying, like, I feel like I'm about to read, and this isn't even really my style, but 
I'm about to read a lot of like, here's why Captain Marvel's good for feminism. Oh, like yeah. she was just she was a she's a bad bitch. Like well, and it believable in a struggling. Like she went through a lot and I'm just so proud of her. And there was a cat there was a cat that was that was just such a, a Goose good the character. cat. Goose the, Goose the cat. cat was great. Goose Should we get into cat. spoilers? Yeah. Spoiler warning on the bottom there. Goose the cat is an alien. <laughs> the botanicals. <laughs> what? Yeah. Still ate shit um, and puked. If you're wondering yeah. why Nick Fury... No, uh, that's too much. That's a spoiler. We're talking about spoilers. We can talk about anything in the movie we want. Nick Fury gets... Uh, cat scratch fever. Yeah, right in the eyeball. And when you get scratched in the eye by an alien cat, you lose I your I also eye. gotta say, the de-aging technology they have now, it's seamless. Why are you so obsessed with de-aging? They just did it, it so well. Is it because you're old? They just did it so well. This is like the third movie we watched in a row where he's been like, de-aging. De-aging was incredible. Voice. They de-aged Sam Jackson. They de-aged Agent Coulson. Dude, that's just Photoshop. No, 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 no. It was professional. They've been perfecting this shit ever since Yeah, they like did it ever with... since Photoshop came out? No, what? Miss, I don't watch any of the movies, so I don't understand what's going on. I understand on. Photoshop. No, you don't understand de-aging technology, though. You mean, like, CGI? Yeah. To make someone look younger? Yeah. You're right, what a fool I am. You did, did you notice it in the movie? No. What do you mean, did I notice it? Sam Action was... Sam Jackson was 20 Sam years... Sam Action. He was 20 years younger. Dude, it's the fucking movies. Have you ever seen... Have you... <laughs> yeah, listen, this one. Right listen. Um, Christian Bale as Dick Cheney? What do, you, what do you mean, did I notice it? Nothing is real in the movies. I just let it happen. My sweet, sweet girl. Dick Cheney in Vice, played by... Christian Bale? Yeah, not de-aging. I know, they did, dude. That I was, was makeup. Say, I was saying... Whatever, we're not going to argue about this on um, camera. Got sh ben, ben Mendelsohn. Mendelsohn. Hashtag Mendelsohn. I fell in love with him. So good in this movie. Green Boys... Listen to me, Green Boys. The Sprawls. I love them. They were great. Love the Green Boys. Love their gross teeth. Love their little nose touching. It was like a star is born nose touching. Ugh, like the love. The yeah. love was real. Um, I feel like it was the perfect amount of funny, is the thing. It was. Like, Thor, t Thor 3, which is the one that annoys me. Dark. Oh, the one that annoys you? Yeah. Um, the gold bloom one? Rad Ragnarok? Yeah. Yeah. Annoys me. Doesn't I think it's a fun movie. I like it. Jeff Goldblum, don't don't unfriend me because of this, because I said that. Um, but no, I feel like that was it was almost like they tried too hard to make everything wicked funny. Yeah. With this movie, it was just it was like natural because it was in like the sarcasm of people and stuff like that. Um, so I really I just liked it. I liked and it, it felt like a '90s movie too in a yeah. lot of ways. And there was the soundtrack, obviously '90s AF REM, TLC, Nirvana. It's like. Someone Googled, give me some buzz bands for 90s playlist, yeah. and then they put it in the movie. I would say that fine. there was one song that didn't work, which was, no doubt, I'm Just a Girl in the World, Gwen Stefani. I'm Just a Girl, is the name of the song. It just didn't work. Here's but. the thing. When the, when the song started, I felt it, and I was like, yes, fucking gonna fight to Gwen Stefani. But then as soon as they started fighting, it just sounded like the radio was on while you were trying to watch a movie. Yeah. But it, I mean, it didn't. It didn't necessarily take away. We just noticed that stuff because we like to review it with you in bed. Yep, that's what we do. And we um, love you. We're gonna rate the movie now. Um, what was the What was the Flarkin. Name? Yeah. So the cat was the not cat's called a Flarkin. Goose is called a Flarkin. Goose Flarkin. So we're gonna rate this. Hey, you know what's more important? One is out that of ten Flarkins. The, the more important thing is that Steve and I. Eventually, you're gonna have children in the first one. Guess what? Its name's gonna be Goose Flarkin. <laughs> <laughs> That's not true. We already decided. Tortilla Pachanga Goose Flarkin. Not not gonna. Happen. <laughs> <laughs> um, also, too, the um, post credit scenes are phenomenal. Great. Uh, really great. Tying. First, I'm not gonna go too too spoiler in there, but it just ties into the next movie, which is Avengers Endgame, which comes out next month. How ballsy is it of a uh, Studio we don't to release have time. We don't have time for a you to movie talk shit about in March, and then another blockbuster in April, and then another one, Spider Man, in like July. Hey, I mean, guess what? Baller. Everyone, everyone knows. Stop. Just baller. Um, I keep Captain Marveling him. 
<laughs> zap. I'm like, I'm sick of a shit. She said, I'm going to zip zap you. Zip zap you. Uh, um, they did a cool, you know how like they introduced like the studios or whatever, whoever makes the movie in the beginning. Remember when it was like, like that, that light that came over and then like poofed into the circle and it was just like scribbles on the circle. You guys all know what I'm talking about. Anyway, Marvel Studios did a cool like their intro was kind of based around Stanley, which was nice. It was awesome. Yeah. S not subtle at all, but it was like it tied into the name of the thing. I don't know where I'm going with that. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make you guys suffer while I think about it. <laughs> All right, what's your score? One out Dude, of ten. Dude, fucking ten flarkins. You can't give a ten flarkins. I know, but it was. I just got back. It was so fun. Um. All right, I'm gonna think. Why do I always have to go first? I'm gonna think in terms of Marvel movies. Okay. Yeah, good. That's good. Good reviewer. Um. I loved it, dude. I'm gonna go eight point six. Okay. Yeah. And the ones that might tie or be higher are like Deadpool and Logan. I think I'm eight point five. Yeah. Yeah. I really liked it. It was like definitely like exceeded my expectations. Wasn't the best movie I've ever seen. Um, and you know it didn't hit that nine for me because last year, Avengers: Infinity War was definitely a, n a high nine for me. Like I earned the nines, so. Dude, this movie isn't about that movie. It's not, but it was it was really good, and it was a good jumping it. point it good to time. that movie. So. Good yeah, time. That's, that's my uh, that's my review. Hey, you know what? Be more spontaneous. Crank up the radio and start a dance party right now. I just what, what kind of? <laughs> Let me try it. What kind Let's of? Let's review slush. this slush shit. What, what kind of this? slush has the audacity to tell you to start a dance party at one in the morning? That's actually not bad. I like this. It's not bad. It's just... It, you know what it reminds me of? What? Uh, when I played Little League in Whitman uh, at the Little League Park. Was that... Um, shit just like this. It was delicious. Was that before Captain Marvel was alive? Yeah. No, it was right at the same time. Me and Captain Marvel. Hanging out. You, yeah, right, dude. Hey, thanks for watching our uh, review of Captain Marvel. Yeah. Uh, don't forget to subscribe... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, the pillow is over. It <laughs> was like the game got, over. It, doesn't it look like sad a little bit? It's like end game. Uh, but subscribe to our channel and give us a like and uh, you know give us a little share share a deal. You know what? No pressure. No pressure though. You no know, pressure. You I'll give high five. You know. Go ahead. I'll send you. I'll send you some pictures of animals. Ready? Let's high five together. Ow. <laughs> what do you mean? Right. Like, can we do it? Can we do yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Hey guys, we'll see you next time. <laughs>